95% of Americans have food sensitivities and we don't even know about it. Not allergies. Allergies we know about immediately. If you eat that shrimp and your throat closes up, you know about that immediately. But a sensitivity is something where you eat a particular food, but two, three days later you're dragging. You can't get out of bed or you have sinusitis or you have acne. Not even necessarily GI symptoms. Everything about you can be a cause of food sensitivity. So here at the IV Lounge, we do not guess, we test. We take four vials of your blood, we send it to the lab, and we figure out what particularly is your body sensitive to. You can be eating nothing but fruits and vegetables and lean meats, grass-fed, and still be poisoning yourself without knowing that. Before doing the food sensitivity test, I actually did a diet that eliminates all processed foods. I started feeling better, but I was still having a lot of gastrointestinal issues. Then I came here for the MRT test and a lot of the foods like chicken, beef, all those hit on my test. So I learned that even though a food may be considered healthy and unprocessed, even if it is organic, no hormones, um, free range, it still may not work with your body. And that's something that you just have to change in your diet to be able to have a healthy lifestyle. We are excited about testing for food sensitivities because we see on a daily basis how the simple test transforms patients' lives.